sounds kind of generic. What is positive thinking? Oh, I just need to think positive is what is on some people's minds. And they think, oh, it's just kind of stupid thing. But no, positive thinking is key in being successful in whatever it is you do. Whether you're an athlete or whether you're an entrepreneur, having positive thinking will get you through. It's easy when things are going well for you to succeed. Whether you are an athlete, I work with Pro Motocross Stars, and these guys, when things are clicking, it seems like it's almost too easy for them. But then when things start to kind of go wrong, whether it's with equipment or issues with the track, whatever it might be, that's when positive thinking comes in handy. And so a lot of the work that I do with them is to help them in times of stress in order to maintain that positive thought process. So for instance, let's say that uh, one of the guys I work with had a bad start at a national. Maybe got off the line pretty late. A lot of, maybe there were half the field, maybe 15, 20 guys were in front of him. And so at that moment, people can choose one or two things. They can either go into stress mode, and when that happens, typically their breathing becomes very shallow or they'll start to hold their breath. They'll start to try too hard. And then they start to think, oh my goodness, I've got another bad start. I'm not gonna do well. This is gonna be a bad day. And so that's one avenue that you can take in that example. The other option is to maintain a positive thought process. And being able to do that will get you through and sometimes get you back into the front of the pack because it will allow them to maintain clarity in their thought process. When you're out on the motocross track and you're going over the obstacles, you've got guys all around you, you know, this is a dangerous sport. And so you, for you to be able to think clear is very, very important. And thinking positive will help you to stay safe and also will improve your results. And so what I'll have them do is to repeat to themselves, say to themselves, okay, this is no big deal. I'm gonna get back to the front. I'm gonna just pass one guy at a time. Whatever it might be, it depends on the rider and whatever it is that they like that they're gonna start repeating to themselves. And so I'm gonna have them do that. I'm also gonna have them work on their breathing. Breathing is a huge part in sports. And when people get stressed and they start thinking negative, they'll start to hold their breath and then they'll start to uh, breathe shallow and then when that happens, there's a lack of oxygen that goes to the brain and there's a lack of oxygen that goes to the muscles. And as a result, they don't have those quick reflexes and then they don't think it's clear and they're making poor choices. And so I will have them focus on their breathing and usually it's these deep belly breaths that I'll uh, engage them in and have them learn what that's like. And it's about breathing deep into your nose and pushing your belly out, and they call it belly breath. A lot of people think when you take a deep breath, it's, you know, your upper chest kind of goes out, your shoulders go up, and that's, that's totally wrong. So you want to fill that lower chest cavity up. And so that way that they get that full deep breath, they get the oxygen that circulates to all their muscle groups that they need to have those quick reflexes. Oxygen goes to the brain so they can make really good choices while they're out there. And a lot of times, the choices they make are so split second and so quick. I mean, it's like you don't even have time to think. However, you have to maintain clarity so you give yourself that opportunity to do it. And so again, being positive will give them the opportunity to do better. Now in business, you know, things are nice when you're starting out, you're a new entrepreneur, and you know, maybe you're like, oh, this is great. I enjoy kind of coming up with a name of the company or I enjoy being able to find if, if the, uh, you know, the domain name is available and I enjoy building the website or designing it, whatever it is that you like, oh, that's fun. And you're typically thinking pretty positive when you get, go through those stages. However, as time goes on, you're burning through cash, you're not making any money, and you start to question yourself. Maybe friends and family go, what are you doing? You're doing this business, maybe you quit your job, you're not making any money, and then the negativity starts to set in. And so those stress levels will go up, and a lot of times people will just quit at that point because they don't have the positivity to get them through those tough moments. And that's why it's so important. So it's not in the beginning, 
when things are fun and things are great as an entrepreneur, but it's a little bit later on when things get tough. Just like an athlete in an example I described earlier about things being tough when you're out there on the track. You don't get the good start and maybe you crash. You've got to go to that positive thought process in order to pick yourself back up and to continue to be successful. Same thing in business. Things are going to go bad, you're going to lose money, employees are going to quit, or you're not going to get jobs for a long time, and you're going to start to second guess yourself. And so stay positive in that moment. What I would recommend for entrepreneurs is to kind of come up with something that you repeat to yourself daily. I wouldn't wait until you know things start to happen. Many times when we wait until we start to have bad things happen, or we're not making the money, or it's just there's just something going on. We're just not having fun. We're not enjoying what we're doing. Um, a lot of times we can kind of prep ourselves each day when we get up and make it a point to say, today's going to be a positive day. Things happen. Regardless of what happens, I'm going to get through the day. And that way, when stuff goes on during the day, you're not going to go, oh, here we go, another bad day. No, you've already prepped yourself early in the day to say, hey, stuff happens. This is just one of those things and I'll get through it. So maintain your positivity to get you through. All right, until next time, take care.